most common uh, banjo roll is, um, you know, if you're going through like E, A, B, A, and E. And you can change it up. What, what I'm doing here on my left hand is I'm, I have the B flat, and I'm hammering onto the B. I'm hitting my B string and my E string. So open strings, obviously, and I'm going thumb, hammer on to the B, open B string, second finger on my E. And then you can bounce off with your B flat to your B. So you're bouncing. Again, you'll hear commercials and stuff like that. Every like little banjo thing, if someone says, oh, give me a banjo thing, the most common is the... But now you can, you know, so it's, it's just having that rhythm and you're bouncing, you're hammering onto your B, hit your open B, and your E with your second finger. Now going to the A, it's the same thing, but a, a different shape. You have your first finger on your A string and your E, barring that. Then you have your third finger on your E flat, and then you're bouncing to your E with your pinky on your G string. Same picking pattern on your right hand. Same thing as E but you have an open string there, so you don't have to make the big stretch. But same, same thing. So for A, same thing. Now going to B, exact same thing, but just up a whole step. Back to A, and then back to E. But your, this never changes, because you have that rhythm. You're keeping that rhythm. chicken pig in there at the end. Okay, this is what I'm doing with my left hand slowly.